Uh, good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Today is the 18th of September 2020. The CDC dive is conducting an anchor recovery for vessel Telos here in Algoa Bay, Anchorage 1, South Africa. <laughs> I don't need a weight belt, Garrett, Be because I'm so heavy, I don't even, if I stop fanning, I f straight down, you know what I mean? Wesley, is your brood mess on? Your brood mess. Secondary check diver one. Watch that. One is secured to diver, both straps are in place. Bailout content reading 220 bar. Numo's chest heart diver has knife diver has just been handed. Numo's chest heart. Umbilical security harness with screw gate in place. Bailout fully open, water turn back. Off at the hat. No visible O rings. Neck dam, neck tag fully extended. Both locking pins are secured and in place. Dava has full PPE. Dava is ready for water once I'm ready for touch. Not a lot of visibility. I would say a meter max. I'm sure if I said. Roger that, Jack. Okay, one left surface. Dive left Diver's on bottom. Diver on bottom, blowing Nemo. Just black on Bullico. Blacking on Bullico. Diver on bottom, 0747. Nemo's hot. Making calls. Yeah, I got you at 19 meters. Roger that, Gareth. 
I did that up, now he's gonna start searching. Roger that. My visibility down here is about four to five hundred. And it's the sand, lots of sand. Okay, got it. Driver starting with his first search. Roger that, starting your first five meter search. Uh, no, uh, there's no car on the down here, kind of at the moment. Okay, Roger. Your visibility is less than a meter, eh? Yeah, now it's getting better. Like one meter? Yeah, you can say one meter. Okay, Roger. Okay, kind of, I'm gonna make my way back into the other direction now. Yeah, Roger that. So, yeah, I'll put another five meters and then go in the opposite direction. Roger that, Gareth. Look at this fish, bro. The chicken. The chicken, really. Yeah, I reckon you can stop there, let out another five meters and come in the opposite direction. Roger that, Gareth, stopping. Leading out another five meters. Attention. Ah, ah, I have it. Like a it. Yeah, I see you have it. Well done, bro. I have it. Got it. Haha. Go fix the clump point uh, down line on top of it. I'm gonna leave the search line on top of the anchor. And then I'm gonna go fetch the shackle and throw it on top of this. Then you guys can send me down this. Then we have a mark. Yeah, Roger that. But the chain you won't find. Look here, yeah, where the chain goes, there's no chain. Yeah, Roger. Prattled by Afrikaans. Make my way over to the down line. Okay, Roger. Well, yeah, if you're gonna bring that down line there, then that can be the shot line for that anchor. So if we went out 20 meters, we would have missed it, Gareth. Yeah, Roger that. Right, the down line. So, Brew, yeah, you can wind up that uh, reel and just keep it on the down line. I will. Like man. And then what we can do is, as we move along that, as we move along that chain, we can just take the down line with it as we move along. Roger that, Gareth. <laughs> There's only about, say, 10% of this anchor that's not under the sand, bro. Yo. Look at the off, the what I call it, the fluke. Yeah. It's completely under the sand. All the way. The chain is completely, I can't see a chain. So what I want to do is I want to dig out here the chain and tie the down line onto that. Yeah, roger that. Because if we get shit see, the, the what's name will move. You know what I mean? The, the, the shackle. Yeah. I'm just looking for a place where I can tie our down line on to. Correct, sir. So we were about 12 meters off our drop mark at it. Yeah, roger that. Yeah. Yesterday I was on a track and now I'm on an anchor. Living the life. Living the life, bro. 90% of the anchor is covered on the sand. Roger, that's only about 10% of the anchor sticking out from the sand and the, um, the chain's about 30 centimeters deep. Yes. That's affirmative, Gareth. Okay, but so, yeah, I see you got uh, 17 minutes 
done, so you've got about half an hour remaining. Um, so yeah, what we can do is just dig up as much as possible. As we find more and more chain, then we can just move the downline further up the uh, chain area and just tie it all. Roger. Yeah, we just dig in. We just dig until we burn all the divers and um, we do what we can, eh? Yeah, it's actually going shallower now. Okay, well that's good. As you can see, I'm digging. Yes, it's chain. There. Can you see anything? Say again? Can you see the chain? No. Yes, the chain under the sand. Okay, Roger. Digging to the next link. Can you hear it starts coming out of the sand? Good stuff, there we go. Can you see it? Yes. Make a bow line, stick it in your over your arm, and then you just swim with it. Roger that, Gareth. If I dive for two hours, your deco will be two hours and twenty-five minutes. Yo. <laughs> Don't kill me today. If I dive you for. If I dive you for three hours, your deco is five hours. <laughs> You'll be fine, man. You're off your con. No, I'm kidding, man. I won't do that. Um, yeah, bro. Now you got about uh, 17, sorry, 15 minutes left. <laughs> You might just feel the guys pulling on your umbilical, they're just making sure your umbilical's clear. Roger that. If it feels like it's getting too tight, then you can just chill there until the guys have re-thrown the anchor. <laughs> your dive's over in two minutes, I'm, I'm telling you now. And then uh, let me know when you leave bottom. Oh, that's the last link. Well done, very well done. Um... Garrett. Yes, Ed. You must just tell Jono we can't uh, put this link through this link. This thing will snap again. Yeah, Roger that. Can't, what's the name, Shackle? It's like I have a look. Yeah, Roger that. And our sling won't fit through this hole. Okay, so we just need to choke it at the sixth link. We must choke it. You know we must choke it. Six link down. You must take it on the second link. Why second? I'll draw it, I'll draw him a picture. What I'm after. Okay, Roger. <laughs> Yo, look, uh, I'll put you through a little deep. Roger that. I was taking up tension on this short line and then I'm gonna leave bottom I'll tell you when I'm leaving bottom Okay, dive left bottom 4.0834, just come up nice and slow Yeah, okay, I'm just gonna blow your Nemo and see what your depth is Nemo's hot. Making calls. Okay, I got you at 8 meters. So you're gonna do a deco at 6. Roger that, Garrett. Making Nemo hot. Nemo's still hot. Making calls. Roger that. Nemo's hot. Making calls. Okay, 
Kurt, dive around stop, 0836. Okay, I'm going to keep you there for two minutes. Roger that, Gareth. Okay, buddy, you can leave your, uh, you, you can leave your stop. Roger that. I have a left stop. I was making as well. I have told them they have a start coming up on the medical for now. Okay, coming up on your medical. Diver on surface, 0839. <laughs> 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 Uh, yeah, it's fine, eh? Yeah, hundreds. Thank you, Roger. Good uh, day, ladies and gentlemen. Today is the 18th of September 2020. The CBC dive, the second dive for the day on the anchor for Tila. Uh, first dive, uh, first the diver located the anchor and uh, located the end of the anchor chain um, for rigging. Dive 2 will now be rigging for the recovery on the Tila. Diver in the water is Jonathan Watkins. Diver left surface. Surface 0923. Yeah, I'll slack down as he goes. Slacking down as he goes. Dive on bottom and on side. Dive on bottom, blowing new mode. Roger that. New mode hot. Roger that. Okay, so you can see the kettle or the uh, kettle linker, Gareth. Roger that. A dive left bottom. Dive left bottom, 10, 10. They can come up slowly on my umbilical. Gareth, no deco. Or oh, safe top, am I good? No, no deco, he's still very good. Roger that. So, if you had to spend two hours down here, guess what your deco would be in six meters? Um, two hours. Just wait. Uh, probably four hours. Two hours and 25 minutes. Ish, good. Okay. Oh, so fucking long, bro.